Gina too is a young woman that admitted to being HIV positive. Why does anyone care? She was seen with a list of celebrities and Nick Cannon being the most notable. Is it because of Mariah or cause he has 3,000 kids? Mission failed. Watch this video for the detailed story. It's not that good, but it got better. Let's get the updates out the way though. How has your eye been progressing since the whole gas bubble thing? Ugh. I actually just had to leave my eye doctor. Why are you mad? Well, don't mind looking. Um, I was wearing my mask, but she caught COVID and left. I am not afraid of COVID anymore. Mm -hmm. That's what I thought too. What if COVID was never a thing and you were coughing up a storm? Would it have been all right for me to have gotten my cheeks out of there? You caught COVID and lived. I'm still surprised about that. There are people that think HIV is a death sentence. Apparently it isn't. Didn't think magic was even strong enough to beat it, but he did. I see it. If she's allowed to judge someone, wait until we get through these updates. Y'all gonna judge me. Gina, are you walking? I get asked a lot. Y'all keep asking me every day, every day. But I can't, man, I can't. Um, there's no walker. I have to do it where I can hold the bed to try to help me out a little. See? I'm trying to buff out the diaper, but anyway. <clears throat> no. I understand the frustrations, just not feeling it though, because you included us into your life. I think you're acting frustrated because you know the hate is about to come, but that's not true. There are people that truly care about your progress. We watched that video of your legs struggling to help your core stand you up, made some of us physically sick to our stomach. Your legs look like they were literally about to break off, and being a builder of bodies, I'm team G2, and thank God you're standing without human assistance, big kudos. But back to it, Miss 2, you are wild. Now you play Dottie Roulette and it, gotcha. it is your responsibility to be a good role model to all of our children. You promoting that loose lifestyle is wild. I've never criticized the way you look, only the mistake you've made. I've even acknowledged your beautiful personality. But people making it seem like we are haters because we are using her mistakes as a teaching moment confuses me. Are y'all part of an agenda that want to pollute the minds of our babies? Y'all need to do better. Don't fucking tell me what to do. You don't know me. I don't know you. I don't want to get to know you. So please, unless you pay my bills, my pay my telephone bills, do you pay my automobiles? I don't think you do. So don't fucking tell me what to do, bitch. If she didn't openly promote it as devil music, I'd be with her. But that music made me do mad dumb things as a young boy. And I see what music do to women, trust me. Y'all already know. But Miss Two, I can tell you what to do. You don't have to listen to it though. That's your right. It's just sad because someone made a comment in this video that is probably true. Gina Two will get herself back to form and there will be guys and maybe even women wanting to dust off some boots. And Miss Two, you know that's nasty. But you open your door to all of this. The more people that know you the more people that will dislike you let's jump on to you using megan stallion to talk for you miss two baby you know me but it's cool ninjas love me you shouldn't have started at that line you have hiv okay body banging i ain't have to let the doctor cut me that's subjective but you should have started right there and the next one of your bones gonna spread lies i'm gonna see you here's the truth gina too you are a naturally beautiful girl you appear to have been lost and confused your path took advantage of your beautiful and accepting personality but you were indeed infected you're amazing right up until you show your ass Tells a large portion of us that you don't see the value you possess. You make it seem cool to live with HIV. And it should be promoted that living with HIV isn't a death sentence. But you need to equally promote the dangers of that lifestyle. Took my eye patch off so you can see me clearly when I say this. Do not message me telling me what I can and cannot post. What I should and should not share. On my platforms. About my life. This is my journey. I'm not telling you what to do. And I'm not telling you to live like me. If you do not like it, you can go away. Have a blessed day.